everybody! Charlie Nair 2 here, and welcome back to Tales of Arise. We last left off, we were exploring the upper level of this palace so that we can uh, see who's really at fault for what's going on here with Prince Dohalim. So let's go ahead and keep checking it out. I think we uh, spent the last episode trying to look for a key. Let's see, where are we at? Let me see if I can press the right button here for map. Alright, let's go out here. Alright, map time. Room. Let's go check out staff. Oh, can we just... No, we can't do that. We have to walk over there. Let's go this way. Can we sprint around these guys? No, we cannot. Looks like we're going to get into battle. It's been a few days since I've last played, so we get used to controls again. I missed Eternal Devastation. There we go. There we go. Everybody right, okay? So we check We're out right, staff quarters. I know we were looking for a key, we didn't find a key. Make sure we just look at everything. Nothing here. There's something right there. Oh. There's a key right here. Is this it? Is this what we've been looking for this whole time? No, this is treasury key. Key to the treasury, considering the country's great affluence, treasury is bound to be impressive. Okay, well we know where the treasury is. We have been looking for that key, but I need to figure out how to get into... Uh, I think it's, what's it called? The Lord's Chamber? Yeah, the Lord's Chamber. That's where we need to get to. But here's the treasury, so let's go ahead and check that out. We need to go to the middle here, and it's to the right, I think. Yeah, right here. Well, here's the treasury. I wonder what says treasury key earth. Is that because this is the earth realm? Okay, there's a guard guy, and there's a gun guy over there. Oh, no, oh, there's extra stuff, too. All right, let's, um... Let's fight the little guys first, like this one. And let's use... Strike. Maybe that did some collateral damage. Can you take care of that? It's almost too strong. Well, that means we can do L2 and up. There we go. That should break his armor, correct? That should get it. Okay. Any injuries? Just like riding a bike. Astral Mass, Bizarre Megacore, and Earthstone. And there's two treasure chests here. Cocktail dress. A vibrant dress of the highest quality that brings out a woman's natural glow and doesn't readily wear out when put through the ringer. Now, is that just... Even more formidable. Okay, so that's actually a piece of armor, right? Equipment... Yes, it is. Nice. Uh, what's this? Uh, let me get this chest before I see what that is. Elixir. Is there anything in the sides? Doesn't look like it. All right, what's here? Shiny gold statue. It must represent a previous lord. 
Huh, that's it? We can just remark? Oh, what's this? There are lots of treasures, assumedly ordered and placed in the palace by the past Mencene lords. Now they gather dust out of sight. Maybe the current lord isn't a fan of them. Is there anything else? That's all just flavor text, right? Yeah. Okay, well, that doesn't help me. I mean, it does. We got the dress, which is nice, but... I still need to get into here. Maybe if I click on it, it'll give me another hint. It's been, man, it's probably been a week, or maybe even two since I last played. Oh, there's R1. Kisara, do you have any idea just what Kelzalik might be planning at the palace? It's hard to say. I've never seen him use any powerful arts, and I don't think he's particularly skilled with any weapons either. However, I have noticed him accompanied by something strange from time to time. What kind of strange? I don't know. I couldn't see anything with him, but I could sense something was there. Probably some sort of Zugal. An invisible Zugal? We'd better be careful in any case. I'd rather we not find out after it jumps us and tries to rip our throats out. Talking about Kelzalik, that was the uh, creepy, like, second-in-command dude, the uh, scientist-looking guy, maybe? All right, we're, hold on, let's... One of these is an office. Here. Need to make sure I look at the tables, because apparently I missed that other key fairly simply. Here. Let's check the walls. Sometimes the little exclamation point doesn't come up until you get right on something. Okay. Pretty sure there's nothing in here. And across the way was dining hall. I think there's enemies in here. Maybe not. Let's check the exterior wall. Well, it's not the exterior wall. It's the walls of this room. The perimeter. There we go. Let's check the table. Not see anything in here. Okay. Fairly certain nothing in these two rooms. Let's, uh... Let's check the map. Plaza. We'll try a meeting room. It's right here, right? Yeah. Altmina Palace. Yeah, that's the name of the palace room. Okay, meeting room. Big old treasure chest over there. Doubt there's anything in it, though. Uh, what's this? My comrades, in the event of an emergency, you are to disengage the barriers and go provide support. You know which room the release mechanism is in. Do not forget to retrieve the key from the office. Now, the key from the office was like the Lord's... No, it was the Noble's, Noble's key, right? Hold on. How do we check this? No, not equipment. Um, items. Noble Room Key, right here. A key that opens the door to the Noble Room in Altlina Palace, a room on the northern end of the second floor replete with lavish furnishings. Certainly that's gotta be... It's gotta be the hint, right? Let's go see. Okay, so that means we need to run past this guy. Uh, we'll probably have to fight these two. Maybe not. Hey, we made it past. Is this it? Noble room? It's locked. It's not the noble room. Where's the noble room? All the way at the end. And there's a guard room. Let's check them both out. So I believe this was barracks? No, guard room. Ok, 
Okay, best offense. We've read that already. Another remark on the weapons. Yeah, we've read that. Alright. It's got to be this room. Take our time, look around. Nothing here. Huh. I thought for sure this is where we'd need to go. I'm not seeing any keys or anything. Okay, let's uh, look at our items. Castle elevator, first floor elevator, that's for a different... All of these are for different ones. Key to hidden chamber, that was for... Bell Prison, Noble Room. Key that opens the door to the Noble Room in Altlina Palace, a room on the northern end of the second floor, repeat with lavish furnishings. We got Savage Key. That's Glanny Need. And Treasure Key of Earth. What am I not seeing here? What is that, dirt? Books. Can I jump on the bed? Can't jump on the bed. Is there anything over here? Doesn't appear to be. Huh. We went to staff. Barracks we didn't go to. Entrance plaza doesn't go to anything. We've already checked the office and the dining hall. Find the release mechanism for the barrier. Well, the only other thing to check would be the barracks? I apologize if this is boring, I just don't quite know where to go and it doesn't seem obvious. I don't even know if this is supposed to be a puzzle. I may just be missing something super obvious here. Alright, just like I did with the treasury key, so let's just make sure we check everything. What's this? Once you occupy the palace, engage the barriers post haste. You know which room to leave the release to leave the release mechanism in. Return the key to the room. Okay, so this is return the key to the room to the specified cabinet. Look, another note from the rebels. Mm. If we combine it with the note we found before, then there should be a key inside a cabinet in the office. In Great. the office. Let's see if we can find it. Okay, so that was it, really. I just had to read that note. I guess I assumed since it was a bookcase that had, that I had already read the uh, flavor text for the book. This is the office, right? Should be a key and a cabinet in the office. Here, yeah. It's like cabinet for storing keys. Really, we didn't expect, we didn't think to look there prior. Duplicate Lord's. Quarters. Even if Danons and Renans aren't on completely equal footing here, both sides still cared about each other. And now we have to fight some of those same Renans inside the palace. Don't forget, we're here fighting to keep what makes this realm so special alive. Don't lose hope, Kisara. Didn't want to transition while he was uh, they were speaking. I figured it would might interrupt what they were saying. Okay, I think we've got some progress now. We need to go to... It's this room, right? Yeah, the one where the guards are in front of. That is a cool sword you got there, sir. 
Can we just sneak in here? No, nope, can't sneak in here. An opponent like this should be easy. Okay, so we can do. Not today. Now, well, it's really take it down. Strike. I accidentally swapped characters when I was trying to do uh, Renwell's art, but it still works. We seem to be getting these uh, burst strikes fairly quickly now. Look sharp! Lightning Yeah. Fairly easy. We may be over leveled and over geared at this point. Alright. Can't even take Peach Dill. SP is accumulated. We need to uh, go ahead and use that. I think it's uh, this button? Yes, it is. Alright, so. There we go. Guard mobility. Let's go ahead and do increased guarding effects for your next one. How do we tag it? There we go. Everybody else is still waiting. All right, what's in this room? Food. This would have been Dolhalim's room, right? Oh, there's a. It's one of those things. We must have a boss fight coming up. That's probably to yeah. That's to unlock. Let's see what this uh, violin over here is about. Unfamiliar instruments are set out on display. You can't touch them. All right, MC Hammer. All right, what do we got here? An eclectic mix of books on high-level academic subjects, gourmet food, curios, and more. The selection provides insights to the character of the owner. How about this one? The Joys of Music Concerto Pieces for Quartets. And this would be his desk. String scores to tug at the heartstrings. So he just really likes music. Okay, let's do this. And then did that finally get rid of the wall? This. To think they would hide it in Lord Dohalim's personal quarters. Right. The nerve of these people. They won't get away with it for much longer. That's right. We have to hurry to the Lord's chamber. Let's go. Alright, so I sense there's a boss fight coming up. And being as how I'm rusty, we are gonna save. What date was this? Oh yeah, it's been about two weeks since I last played. Alright. Overwrite this one. Okay. Open sesame. Hopefully we won't get our butts kicked here. Now, if we are fighting a boss here, this is the Earth Kingdom, right? Let's check this out. Equipment. Warrior emblem. Do we have anything that nullifies earth damage? We do. We have opals. So tell you what, we're going to put an opal on this guy. And we're going to put one on our healer as well. Give you an opal. Why can't I? There we go. Your attack goes down, your penetration goes down, but that's okay. She's fine. She's got light, dark damage. She's got null poison? Is that really what she needs? Whatever brings her defense up is what she needs. Defense and HP. Here's a lot of HP. That actually might be worth it. That might be better than the defense. 300 more HP. Black Onyx. Resistance might be worth it too. Resistance up by 96, but defense only down by 17. That's not bad either. This does elemental defense and minus 50% of light and dark damage. That's not bad either. Let's see what else we've got that comes close to this. Ninety-six and twenty. And earth damage down ten percent. Okay, that's what we're going. We're going to save one more time. I know this is uh, infuriating, but I don't want to have to set that up every time. I'm assuming since we're in the Earth Realm, 
We had an earth key that was kind of like hinting. Maybe we're going to fight an earth boss. If not, and we get our butts kicked, we'll change our gear accordingly. This is the treasury. Pay no attention to what I just did. It was merely a warm-up. Here is where we want to go. Alright, story time? Probably story time. Yeah, that's him. Is he... Are we not supposed to hear what he said? Well, well, if it isn't the slaves and the traitor. I don't remember giving you permission to enter the palace. So it's true. You really are the one behind all this, Kelzalik. I don't remember giving you permission to speak either. Know your place, slave. Hmm. Well, you're gonna now die. Now see his true colors. Yeah. A despicable excuse for a human being. The really? I guess that makes him pretty ordinary, huh? Yeah. That's uh, it's a true statement. Kelzalik, you were Lord Dohalim's most trusted advisor. His closest ally. Why would you betray him? Don't be a fool. I didn't serve him because I wanted to. I expect a mere slave would know, but there are many powerful contenders for the position of Lord. A contest of strength determines the one who will be Lord and undisputed ruler of a realm. There is no choice in the selection. If my master had any ambitions of becoming the sovereign, I would have gladly served him. But he had no intention of fighting for the crown. Indeed. Can you slaves even imagine how that looked to the rest of us? Enduring the whims of an ambitionless lord, all we could do was wait for the end as we suffered through our humiliation. You want suffering? Try being Danon for a day. So you plotted against Lord Dohalim in secret. And when my brother found out... And I would do it all again if it meant returning Menancia to its rightful state! A realm where Danons are slaves and Renans their masters. It's the natural order. Ooh, she's Enough. big mad. Who are you to decide what is natural or rightful, traitor? Miguel. My brother. He dreamed of building a world free of suffering. He gave his life for that dream. And all you've managed to build is a lake of death. You. You killed my brother. And now you'll Let's die go. for it. He does have an invisible Zoogle. Is it earth based? It doesn't look earth based. Finno Plage. Alright, does it tell? No, nope. doesn't tell anything about it. Is there anything different to aim at? There's its tail appears. So that's what we'll go for. Why should I concern myself with the passing of one pathetic slave? I should probably take an earth attack away. It can hide itself? The earth attack seems to still do damage to it. Oh, it's got poison. We need anti-poison on everybody. Okay, it doesn't seem too difficult to be honest. It's gonna do its poison spray. Who's dying? I'm dying. No, Renwell's dead. Renwell always dies. Did she cast Reser? Yes, yeah, she, she Reser. Try to stay away from that. We got Moth in here. Freaking me out. Ready for it to like get knocked on its butt. There we go, core break. She's 
big mad. Look at that. She just threw a giant shield down. Flare demolished. Okay, so we should have left our anti-poison gear on. It's okay. It's not the worst thing. Whoa, how did that hit me? What was that? Let's do this. Should knock it down. Is its, its weak point is not backed up yet, so let's just keep welling on it. I'm just using all the arts that I have available to me. Oh, just gonna do that attack. Hey, its weak point is back again. Can we use... Yeah, let's use Law here. Who's hurting? Kassara's hurting. She's back. I wish I could tell everybody else to attack this part. Trying to get around it, and the wall of the arena is keeping me from getting back there. Let's knock it down. There we go. We got a strike again. Not too difficult. Uh, Anti poison would have been good. You got it halfway down. Oh, there's ads. Let's get the ads. Uh oh, what'd it do? Oh, it's running around. We need to have uh, Shield Lady do her attack. I'm trying to kill this bug if I can. Man, it's still alive. Strike, maybe that'll help damage everything. Is there any more bugs? No. Alright, if it runs around again, whoop, looks like it might. We need to do shield. Yeah, he did shield. Didn't appear to do anything other than just hurt me. Let's do this. There we go. Let's just well on it. Uh oh, I'm hurting. Can you uh help me? Hopefully, it's uh four will come back. Come on, Rimwell, get it. Oh, watch out, we're gonna die. I know that won't stop it, but at least we can try. Alright, people are hurting. How do we use items again? I can't quite remember. Recasting. Recasting. Can't use items? What's up? Items. Life bottle on Kisara. Try to get everybody healed. My CP is down, so I need to use items. So orange gel. Use. Gotta get everybody healed back up if you can. And then recasting. Items. Uh, heavy treat does everything for everybody. Let's do peach gel. Or sh myself. And recast. We need Kisara. Items. Peach gel. Shion? 
Maybe that's enough. Let's try to block this attack. There we go. Uh oh, he's doing the. He's doing the weird attack thing. Does that work? Yes. I think we can kill him. I think we'll get him. We gotta get out of the poison here. Four is broken. Everybody do everything you can. Alright, who's hurting? It's like Kassara is. Hold on, he's gonna do crazy attack. Yeah, look at that dodge. Alright, his weak point is back. Uh oh, I'm hurting. Ooh, that's a good hill. Come on, let me do an attack. Alright, I think we killed him. You filthy slaves are despicable. Your dreams of attaining lordship are no more. Give up, Kelzalik. Attaining lordship? <laughs> Ridiculous. Only those who possess a master core can become a lord. <laughs> what did you think just anyone could do it? But then, what were you trying to accomplish with this? Didn't you betray your lord? Yes, that's true. However, there are other lords. Other lords? So you mean... Whoa! So Helene for the win! I thought we last, killed the truth him? Is revealed. Dohalim, where have you been this whole time? Clean me up. Kelzalik, you've made your last of these. The fruit of Helgen? It can't be. You found my production facility? Correct, and I tore it down, but something still troubles me. It's clear that this is no ordinary fruit, nor was the equipment used to grow it. You couldn't have done all this without outside assistance. Indeed, something like this must have come from another realm. Mahatsar, perhaps? <sighs> you actually expect me to talk now? At this point, the contest for the crown will be over soon enough, and you will finally receive the punishment you deserve for your weakness. I've already received my punishment. <laughs> May this be my final act as the Lord of Elder Men and Zia. <laughs> Go to Mahaksar, Ganeth Horrors, wherever you think you'll find a suitable lord. <laughs> Should have killed him. Should have caved his face in. This is going to bite us in the butt later. She knows it too. Are you alright with this? He killed your brother after all. He did. But then I thought, he's nothing more than one common ordinary Renan. He's not worthy of my time or my anger, right? <sighs> So after everything, was the dream of coexisting just a dream? What is that? What are we hearing? Those are the cheers of the brave Danans who overpowered Kelzalik's forces. Wait, they challenged the Renans? Indeed. A militia made up of Danan guardsmen, Renan supporters, and of course, the Gold Dust Cats. Do we have you to thank for bringing them all together? Regardless of what your original motivations were, your dream of coexistence saved countless lives. 
And now, those people out there are fighting to keep that dream alive. That's something real. Be that as it may, they do so now by their own hands. These people no longer need any lord. Where are you going? To put an end to the crown contest. So long as its madness persists, peace will remain ever out of reach. I cannot allow it to continue. The crown contest impacts far more than just the Danans. You're choosing to fight Lenegas and the entire Empire. I am well aware. However, if I wish to keep this dream from dying, then I have little choice in the matter. Besides, it's the least I can do. <sighs> hmm. I love the blue on his outfit. Doppeline. So you're gonna go out there and make that dream real on your own? You may be decided on your path, but that doesn't make it any less difficult. Why not walk that road with us? Yeah. Is he is he gonna be a party Pardon? member? You heard me. Ooh. We're fighting to liberate the Danans. You're fighting for the people Ooh, of this I realm. Replace. I'd say we're on the same path, really. It would only make sense for us to walk it together. No. Nope. Danon dissidents side by side with a Renan lord? Not the least intriguing invitation I've received. An invitation which would only be proper courtesy for me to accept. Are you gonna do it? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Sweet. Wonder hey, would he be DPS? Be I don't see her anywhere. Well, don't tell me we lost Kasara. Maybe she just needed some time alone. A lot's happened. That makes sense. She did just lose her brother after all. <sighs> We ought to keep moving as well. So long as there are lords who draw breath, we have a mission to complete. Kisara's a big girl. I'm sure she can handle herself. We should hurry on ahead to our next destination. I guess you're right. And it is a lot safer here than it was. What do you think, Dohalim? I am not sure I have the right to say anything as far as Kisara is concerned. Fair enough. So, did we lose Kassar out of the party? Because well, I'm a little upset with that. Well, I, for one, would like to say that. goodbye if we get a chance. Let's keep an eye out for her as we leave. Maybe she can come with us. Friend of Dohalim. Ah, Kassar left. Master Core of Earth. Cheese fondue recipe. Ooh, cheese fondue sounds good. Okay, so that's going to do it for this episode. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy my content, please consider a like, a comment, and or a subscribe. Stay tuned for the next episode. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.